Hi, and welcome back to the Gun Viking channel. Today I'm going to test some Agila High Velocity. I have tested them before in my Tikka. You can see the link to the video up in one of the corners, if you want to see that one. Please watch this one first. Today I'm going to use my Bergara BXR with a Carlos CL Helia on top, a 4 to 12 by 52. I'm just a little bit afraid that I won't be able to get it low enough because this is a hunting scope. So, and it's a, it's a 30 MUA rail on the rifle. I just put it on so it's gonna be exciting to see when I'm shooting the chrono shots if I'm able to get it low enough, especially with high velocity ammunition. The rifle itself has a 16 and a half inch steel barrel. They claim it to be a match barrel, that's left to be seen. Uh, the trigger is a three and a half pound, well, it's a good 1022 trigger. It's no match trigger, but it's quite good to be a 1022 trigger. And the rail itself has a 30 MUA, so we can really stretch the, the distances. But again, I think that might become a problem with this hunting scope. So I might have to buy some kind of target scope so I can get low enough. Well, it's only one way to find out, and that is to try the rifle. So, let's do some shooting. As you can see, my fear was well rounded. It isn't possible to get this scope low enough. It just isn't enough vertical adjustment. I'll do this test with this scope, but for future tests, I have to get another scope. The chronograph tells me that the maximum velocity is 1207 feet per second, and minimum is 1162. This gives us an average of 1193 feet per second. This is a spread of 45 feet per second and a standard deviation of 13. Well, it's time to make some holes in the target. 